Hello everyone. Today we are going to guide you on how to manage the employee relationship and device configuration in the CAM attendance portal. To begin with, click on device, then select device list. After that, click on add device in top right corner. Now, add device serial, location, device name and select log type as attendance. Lastly, click on add device. After that, you will see your newly added device details on the screen. Now, to edit the device details, click on three dots under action and click on edit. After that, in the edit device, click on status and select inactive or active as per requirement. Then in location, you can select any location for the said device and finally click on update. Then you will get the notification of device updated successfully. Now click on filters and go to device name. Then you can select any device name from the list as per your need. And lastly, click on apply. After that, you will be able to see the selected device details on the screen. Also, from the filters, you can search your device by selecting device serial, device name or locations and finally click on apply. Then you get the filtered list of all the selected devices on the screen. Now click on device list. After that you will see all linked device list on the screen. Then click on Kent Delhi as an example. Now you will be able to view all details of the device. Moving ahead, now click on export data. Then you can download an Excel file with all the required device details. After that, click on employee relationship. Then go to right hand top side and click on options and select import data then click on select from the computer and choose your data file from the computer. Now click on link new employee then you can see the details of all the employees. Then select the employees one by one by clicking on check mark or select all to link the employees with the device. Lastly, you will get a pop-up asking you to link new employees. Click on confirm. Then you will receive the notification employees successfully linked. After that, click on options. Click on export data to get an excel file with all the employees detail. You can also delink certain employees if you want. Select the required employees by clicking on check mark and lastly click on delink employees. You will get a pop up asking you do you want to delink employees. Click on confirm and you will finally receive a notification of records successfully delinked. After that, click on employee relationship. Then go to select device and as an example, select demo device, Kent Noida. Now click on link new employees. Then you will see the details of linked employees on the screen. By clicking on the filters, 
you can also search the employees on the basis of given parameters now click on the global device setting to change various parameters associated with device with mode your device can be set up to recognize either continuously or in out mode you will be asked for confirmation that are you sure you want to change this setting click on change and finally you will get pop up saying global device setting updated the next parameter is mask compliance which you can enable or disable basis your organizational requirement you also get an option to change the number of days of data retention on device select it to 30 days if you want maximum retention a pop up will ask you change data retention on device click on change similarly you can change duration of master data sync interval and confirm the change for becoming effective notification global device setting updated shows the setting were successfully changed after that click on device configuration select location as test kent noida in device select demo device after that by clicking on brightness you can adjust the brightness as per your requirement then click on bluetooth which can be turned on or off if you are using access control bluetooth relay then the bluetooth setting becomes important for integrating it after that click on volume and go to alert type then you can select either tone or voice standard or voice personalized you can also adjust volume to be low medium or high now click on configuration then turn on allow add employee from device which helps in easy onboarding of employees in time format select it as 12 hour or 24 hour in date format select it as day date month or day month date in the alert language choose it as english or hindi in logs type you may select attendance or entry or both in device type select as in out or both as per requirement in the camera choose it as front or rear after that in the information display duration you can select it from 3 second to 10 second according to need then under interval between two recognitions of same employee you select any value under minutes and seconds as per your choice now click on sensitivity and choose appearance closeness as per your requirement then click on customize display where you can personalize the attendance machine according to your brand colors and logos change the top bar background color logos background color or font color as per your guidelines then click on device pin to change it from default 000000 as an example enter the new pin as 123456 and finally click on set thank you for watching this video see you soon in our next tutorial video